Hey everybody, this is Brad. I um, just finished my last workout with Body Beast here and uh, figured it was time to make a little uh, review video about my experience with the workout. Um, but before I get into the whole like, you know, ins and outs of it, I'm sure you're just wanting to see what my results were with it. So uh, here's my photos and also uh, my measurements uh, from the beginning, middle and end of it. So check it out. Okay, so was the first thing that came to your mind when you took, checked out my photos was like, man, does that guy look kind of fat? Uh, that's kind of what was going through my mind when, um, when I got done at the end or even in the last four or five weeks of the work, I just felt like, I, I don't say fat, but full. And, uh, but yeah, you know, I put 24 pounds on in the lat, you know, over the, the the time period there, and the workout took me 138 days to get done. I didn't finish it in 90 days. It's, I, I don't know how people do it. Um, you know, I, I was I play softball two nights during the week. I I put 200 and something miles on my mountain bike in that time period. Uh, I traveled uh, about six days. I still worked out, just didn't do body beast. Um, I had, you know, maybe like 10 lazy days where just, you know, I was exhausted from either, you know, playing sports and working out the day before. Um, I also missed a week due to a, in, in, uh, an injury that I had. So I had to, you know, take a week off. So when you kind of add up all those days, you know, it comes out to, you know, about 138 days to get the entire, you know, 90 days done. Um, I, I really liked the workout. It was uh, it was it was a lot different than most of the other beach body workouts that I've done. You know, it was just straight up just weightlifting. Um, you know, not a lot of fancy moves. A lot of just you know presses, curls, you know squats, lunges, things like that. And, and um, it, a couple of things that I, I really liked about the workout was you know since you're just doing these. You know, you're doing a lot of simple moves, but the workouts were only like 30 minutes to 45 minutes long. So it didn't take a lot of time to do it. Um, maybe one of the only like little, you know, quirks about the workout is that um, like I have the Bowflex Select Tech dumbbells and it's kind of hard to like, you know, click them in and out to keep up with, you know, the trainer there. So I have to pause it every once in a while. Um, but the, the workout was... It, it, it was a really good, it was a really good workout. I mean, I, I, I was maxing out the amount of weights that I could lift, um, by about the six week, like doing the, the presses and things like that. Like I got to the point where I, I doubled, if not tripled my numbers on, on every single, you know, workout sheet that I, you know, that I had, I mean, I was, I was doubling, if not tripling in every single move. And, you know, I only had 50 something pounds in my uh, on the the select text there, I also had um, the curl bar, which you could use for the leg exercises and um, obviously doing curls and bend over rows and stuff like that. And you know, I mean, I was able to lift a, a, a lot more weight than uh, what I could at the beginning. Um, now, I, uh, I I don't think it's possible to put on that much weight in in ninety days. Um, without taking the supplements. I mean, I was, I was taking all of them. I was taking the fuel shot, the, you know, the, the creatine, you know, the whey protein stuff. And then this, the sumeru here, which, you know, you take this stuff and I, I can definitely feel it kicking in within about 30 minutes. And, you know, I had to actually like cut down the, the creatine in half because I was just starting to put on so much weight where I felt like winded doing certain things around the house. Um, so, uh, the last like four weeks after doing the the bulk phase, I definitely had to uh, you know cut down on the supplements. But um, uh, I eat pretty well. I give myself about a B plus. You know, I, I um, uh, one of the things I don't really like about the Beachbody meal plans is that they give you all these recipes and stuff, but they don't say like uh, eat this 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 you know and just give us an entire ninety day plan. Like I I do a lot. Uh, better when when that kind of plan is given to me um 
But, you know, I was taking Shakeology too every single day along with taking the supplements after the workout. Um, you know, I still have like my cheat meal every, uh, you know, every Friday or Saturday. So, but for the most part, I, I eat well, you know, about 90% of the time. And, um, uh, but you know, like in this workout here, it said to eat, for me to eat about three, almost 3,100 calories a day for me to, to do this. And I know I came up short, um, eating that probably more than what I thought. So, you know, to put on that weight, I, I really feel the supplements had a big deal with it. Um, now, one thing though, that kind of, uh, shocked me was, uh, my clothes just did not fit anymore right around like week six, like when I kind of got into the middle of the bulk phase. And what I didn't uh, notice until, you know, week six or seven was that I accidentally started out, you know, I started out doing the huge beast program and I accidentally flipped over the thing and did the lean beast um, since the fourth week. And the workouts are basically the same. You just flip like one or two more weeks in different areas. But, um, but yeah, my, my clothes, like my shirts, my, my pants, like I had to wear, I had to bring out a pair of, uh, old baggy pants. I like to call them my fat pants because I was not fitting into any of my old jeans, any, anything, my shirts, button down shirts. I've basically been wearing one pair of pants and uh, t-shirts for the last, uh, almost two months now. And, uh, I don't want to go shopping just because I know I'm going to drop the weight when I get back doing other programs. But, um, but yeah, so that's one thing too, that I, I did not expect to put on that much weight. And as you can see from my measurements, like my waist went up, my thighs got bigger, my arms got bigger, my shoulder got, everything just got bigger. So I just don't fit anything else anymore. But, um, so that's kind of been an experience too. Um, but you know, like I, I did get a lot of like comments from like friends and family, like my girlfriend, like my buddy's wives are just like, wow, like you look, you know, everyone's like, you look good. I'm like, oh, thanks. You know, but, uh, um, I don't feel comfortable, uh, at the weight that I'm at right now at, at, you know, 202 pounds. I, I've never been this heavy before in my life. Like I know that I'm very strong, but yeah, you know, I don't know if I'll ever do another 90 days of a body beast again, just because, um, you know, of that, I can see myself maybe doing like 60 days of it would be good. Um, definitely mixing in some of the workouts with, uh, some of the other, you know, beach body programs that I do. Um, one thing that I'm kind of excited though about is, you know, I did body beast at the very end of like my sports season here in Michigan, like uh, at the end of my softball season. So, you know, it's, um, beginning of December and, um, what what I you know plan to have plan to do now is to go into some of the other programs that I do you know like P90X or Insanity or Asylum and what I'm really hoping is that you know from the bulk and the muscle that I put on that those workouts are going to lean everything out and hopefully I'll still be able to keep most of the strength so then when I get into the next season of you know playing the sports like March April that. Um, you know, I'll be just a whole bunch stronger. I'll get my speed back up and things like that. So, um, but all in all, I mean, Body Beast, it did exactly what it said it was going to do. And it said to get you huge. And that's exactly, you know, what happened to me. So, you know, I would say that it was a good program because because of that. So, yeah, if you have any questions about Body Beast, um, you know, any part of it, just leave me a comment and uh, or shoot me a message and I'll get back to you. So uh, thanks for listening and uh, I'll talk to you later. Bye.